Hello children. Today we will be doing unit 5 from our Marigold textbook. The name of the poem is Zoo Manor by Eileen Matthias. Children, have you been to a zoo? A zoo is a place where animals like lion, tiger, deer, giraffe, birds like peacock, parakeet and reptiles like snakes, crocodiles, alligators are kept in enclosures and taken care of. People like you and me can go to the zoo and see the animals and learn more about them. The animals in the zoos have feelings too and they also understand everything that's going on around them. Tell me, when somebody makes fun of you or teases you, do you feel sad, upset or angry? Well, animals also feel the same. So remember, when you go to the zoo to see the animals, be good to them. Well, this is what this poem is all about. So shall we read then? Zoo Manners by Eileen Matthias Be careful what you say or do when you visit the animals at the zoo. Don't make fun of the camel's hump. He's very proud of his noble bump. Don't laugh too much at the chimpanzee. He thinks he's as wise as you or me. So here children, the poet says that whenever we visit a zoo, we should be very careful about what we are saying, what we are doing, because the animals understand everything. We should not make fun of the camel's hump because he is very proud of it and he feels bad if you tease him. We should not laugh at the chimpanzee because he thinks that even he is as clever as you or me. Okay? And the penguins strutting around the lake can understand remarks you make. Treat them as well as they do you and you'll always be welcome at the zoo. And here the poet says that do you know the penguins walking around the lake can understand everything that you say. Each and every comment that you make, they understand that. So we should treat them well as they would treat you. And only then you will be always welcome at the zoo. They will always look forward to having you around if you are a good viewer, if you are a good visitor. Alright children? Now let's just have a look at the new words from the poem. Proud. Being proud of something or someone. Being happy or being pleased about that thing or person. For example, when I completed my work before time, my teacher said, I am proud of you. Noble, royal or majestic. For example, the prince belonged to a noble family. Wise, clever. For example, Beepal was a wise man. Penguins. They are black and white colored flightless birds which can live on land and in water. For example, penguins look very adorable. Strutting. Walk in a proud manner. For example, the peacock came strutting into the garden. Remarks. Comments. For example, we should not make rude remarks about the animals in the zoo. Children, what did you learn from the poem? We should be kind towards the animals. We should not make fun of them. We should enjoy their antics but not laugh at them or tease them. Will you remember that? Very good children. So that's it for today children. Learn the poem well and write down the new words in your classwork notebooks. I'll be back with the exercises in the next video. So till then, stay safe, stay healthy. Good day children.